Hi everybody, it's Roxy from Feather Perfect Memories. Welcome to week 47 in my Project Life album. It is for November 16th to the 22nd. So first off, I start with my photos and I cut them apart and I decide which ones I'm going to keep and where I'm going to put them. And then I go through my cards uh, to create a color scheme. So that little card that I have moved around twice now that says Peppa Penny. It was just one of those cards that's in, you know, an order and I just thought it was pretty and I just wanted to use it. It's a little bit um, smaller than a 4x6 but I don't care. I'm just going to incorporate it into my layout. So I'm kind of going with those greens and those pinks and those blues for this layout. So I'm just trying to decide which ones I want to use. So first of all, I went to a nursery with a friend and I planted, I bought a plant and a new planter and I planted it together. So I wanted to document that because I just thought it was so cute. It's a little Buddha head with some succulents in it. I chose a succulent that I thought would droop well for hair. So I'm just going to go through like my little embellishments bowl, which is really getting full at the moment. I need to go through it and see if there's anything that I want to take out and give to my daughter. And I'm trying to decide what to do in the middle of this card. And I thought those three tags are super cute, but then they clashed with the other colors. So I decide on this Allie Edwards chipboard circle, and it just covers up the words Peppa Penny perfectly. So that card is now done. Now I'm trying to decide to do what, what to do with this Buddha, and I'm using those tags again. And I cut the top the white off and it still did not work for me. So now I'm going to go through my chipboard stickers I have in my bowl. So these are all ones that I'm wanting to use because the sheets are getting low. And I decide on this Namaste one. I just thought it was fitting for the Buddha head. And I put that on that card. So this card is like a um, clouds and sky one. So I thought it would be perfect to do my week number or my week title card on here. So I'm going to use Kelly Winnell Stamps High Street Alpha. I love this alphabet. It kind of looks like a typewriter sort of um, larger font. And um, I'm going to use these Allie Edward numbers. They came in my December Daily kit this year and I didn't use them for my December Daily. So I've pulled those out because I thought they would look perfect on this dark cloud. Um, they just have a bit of a film over the top so I'm struggling to get those off. So I'm just deciding what I want and then I have a hashtag chipboard sheet. Here we go and I'm going to choose one of those to use to do for the number of the week because I'm going to incorporate some chipboards into this layout. So I'm just writing NOV for November now and then I'm going to use some wood veneers to do the numbers. So I'm going to pull out my box of alphabet things here and I'm going to find um, 16 through 22 and then I have this little love heart so I thought it would just be perfect. So I'm going to arrange all of those and then put those back in my box and move my box away. And then I'm just using my Tombow Mono Liquid Glue on these and I just put a little bit on the back and adhere those down. I'm going to adhere these uh, pieces down from Allie Edwards with a staple because I just thought they would look cute and it was too hard to glue them down. Moving on to this photo, it's a photo of my daughter and I at the dog park. We go to the dog park nearly every day after school and work and just use this bit of washi tape from Studio Calico and I pulled out my stamp set again, the High Street Alpha, and I'm going to write dog park hangs. So such an easy stamp set and it is a smaller one which is good so when you want to do little titles like this it fits perfectly on these four by six cards or even three by four cards if you have a small enough word um and i almost didn't fit it on because i didn't put the a and the n next to the h close enough um, so i'm just kind of shove it in there and you know what it's not perfect but it works I also have this other stamp set from Kelly Winnell Stamps and it's called Currently 2019. It's got like little um, clock things on it. So I'm just going to put 5.30 p.m. because that's the time that we arrive every evening. So I thought that was pretty 
a good idea to add onto the bottom of that card. And then there's just, I wanted to add a little embellishment, so I just chose this little star. It has a sentiment on it, but I can't remember what it says. Um, and then there's this little flag that says, like, um, perfect or something. Um, moving on to this next card, it's of this giant pizza I ordered. I was not expecting it to be this big. I trimmed it down so it fit on this little tags card. And this little embellishment piece that says, for the record, I think I've had it in my stash for eight years. No joke, you guys. Um, so I'm finally using it. I think it's the last of the little bits from that cut apart sheet that I had. As you can see, it was a cut apart sheet from the back. Just going to use this little tag and writing a little bit of journaling about it being so huge. Um, going to pull out my wooden veneer box and I wanted to find a little emoji um, to put a smile on them, to bring that those um, wood veneer pieces throughout the whole way up. So this is me at the dog park. I just used this little flag sentiment and I'm trying to think of something else. I wanted to make sure I notated the name of this dog because it's not my dog. Um, but every time you sit down, a dog always comes into your lap. So this dog is Luna. And so I'm just going to use my Brilliance White Ink and my Big Giant Roller Stamp. And I'm going to stamp the word Luna. So easy, you guys. And it turned out so cute. One fine day together. Next, I'm moving on to this card, and um, I'm just not going to do a lot to it. I'm just going to do all around the edge, and there's this little embellishment piece that says sweet. So I'm going to put that on there. This was me and my friend at the nursery that I spoke about earlier. So I'm just going to put this label in the middle, and then this little flag here. And then I'm going to journal about um, going to the nursery. We went to two nurseries together and then had lunch. It was such a great morning. We spent too much money. Course. Um, so that journaling is on a Kelly Perky label, which I am running out of, you guys. My favorite colors are coming to an end. So I hope you guys enjoyed this layout. If you have any questions, uh, please leave me a comment below. And it looks like I decided to add a little bit more wood veneers here at the end just to balance it out. So a little leaf on that top one and a little rose on that bottom one. Okay, I hope you guys have a lovely day. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you again soon.